going to do the cut, rotate around, cut in. Okay, so basically you have one, rotate here, you push across. This weapon is not a knife. Again, pop, cut, rotate, hit, boom. What you want to do from here, since you have it here, is actually cut here. Okay, boom, rotate and cut the face. Boom, rotate it. Yes. He has the hand tight. So when I hit, okay, it softens the, the movement. When I'm pulling back, it locks. This, all I have to do is push it off. There's that move. Okay? So when you're pulling off the hand, it has to get, what happens if he does this? You're gonna have to wrench it out of his hand? No, go for the break. Well, not here, but you know what I mean. Go for the break, that's the only way to get the, the weapon out of the hand. Let's do it. The science is what makes you create. If you don't, if you can't create what I'm doing, make your own way, then you're just going to be an instructor all your life. You'll never be a teacher. There's a lot of instructors, not very many teachers. Moses Paul was a teacher. He taught me the way. I'm hoping I'm doing the same thing. So here's the question that, uh, what was the question? <laughs> the go cube. Oh, after I'm in the go cube, okay, and I'm coming in for the cut, and he stops it. He goes, well, what exactly are you doing here? Are you hyperextending the elbow? How's that working? What you're really actually doing is cutting the hand so I can peel it off. That's what you're doing. But I can do this, but he can put his weight in, and now I lose my balance. But by doing this, it keeps him from moving. That's exactly what I'm doing. You think you about it? I'm saying this throws me off. I'm like, what are you trying to do here? <laughs> ah, you're dead anyway. Looky, looky, balls on looky.